What is up everyone, Northside here, welcome to my channel. We are going to go through the patch notes which are posted by Julia Nitocris on Friday tonight and they're going, going to be in effect from Tuesday, if I'm not mistaken, 7th uh, next week. Uh, now there are good things in the patch notes and there are some very controversial things that I really dislike and there's a one portion of regarding the Paladin that I would need an explanation from the people who play the class. Is it a nerf or what is it? So without further ado, let's just jump to the patch notes and let's go and just check them out. Here we are, patch notes, as I said, posted on Friday, September 3rd, as you can see. And there will be, if I'm not mistaken, as I said, in effect next Tuesday. So keep that in mind because this is important for one portion of the patch notes. Now the patch notes are quite extensive. Well, not quite ex extensive, but they actually managed to fail to in two patch notes to unbind the items like uh, Vorpal enchantment, like the companions. So I guess that was really unprofessional and that's why they're kind of placing this beforehand. So we're going to actually start with the reward claims agents. Uh, a lot of people were upset about the Bard Entourage pack and uh, the fashion set. So for players who purchase the Bard Entourage pack, the reward claim agent now has a minstrel fashion set with originally advertised look. So that is fixed. As I said, not everything is bad in these patch notes. Now, this is a one-time claim and it's also available for players who purchase the Bard Entourage pack in the future. For players who are stuck in the quest running a workshop, there is a now auto opening pack at the reward claims agents to give artisans a player may have dismissed. To prevent yourself from becoming stuck again, please do not decline any of these artisans if given the option. You may dismiss them later if desired after the tutorial quests are complete. So this is actually good. About the release notes, about the content and environment. I'm going to totally skip this. So there are various fixes to Ice Pirate Peak. Uh, Infernal Citadel uh, also had a bug where players should no longer teleport re repeatedly between the Hall of Chains and the Abyss, which was highly annoying to some players. And we have some minimaps and various, various fixes. So I'm going to totally skip this part uh, of uh, content and environment and switch uh, directly to combatant powers. Now this is what I was talking about. Classes and balance, combatant powers, paladin. The healer mark can no longer be applied to multiple players at a time. This mark is now removed when one character moves too far from a paladin, which means after teleports of certain distances, the mark may need to be reapplied. Now I need pal whoever plays paladin to explain to me is this a nerf? Or is this was not working as intended? So please in the, leave me in the comment section what this actually is. Because I know the Paladin is not in a good state and is being uh, pumped from behind uh, really, really bad. As, as far as my commenters are saying. So uh, now we're going to switch to items and economy. Binding fix. Now this binding fix, this is the third time they're trying to fix this. Now, upon logging in, all Vorpal enchantments and all Vorpal enchantments and legendary companions from the legendary companion bundle will have their bound status removed once and can be freely traded or resold. This include enchantments which were previously bound to characters unrelated to this bug. Enjoy and thank you for your patience. Well, you are welcome, I guess, because you uh, messed up two times. And this is the third. I I don't want I don't want to make this video for the fourth time. So I really hope you will fix this. Now in the general section we got fairy steps that I actually use. Uh, we'll, it, it's just changed now. Grants accuracy instead of critical strike. And of course uh, there was an issue with uh, barred weapons. So gray cloak gray cloaks rapier should now should now be able to be used by bard. So when they say they, when they wrote should, they're not even sure. So we're gonna have to wait and see. And also gray cloak weapons now have stats appropriate for their level and classes. Also there was an issue or a bug, uh, vestigial of the bard 
this artifact now properly has 60 second cooldown at mythic rank instead of i think it was three minutes storm kicks thunder also uh the this is also a good thing the, the campaign currency can once again be purchased via genius gifts it was a bug a known bug and it was highly annoying to a lot of people now while currency purchase via genius gift is not intended to be double by double campaign currency event we will still enable the double storm king tiger campaign currency event for the week after this goes live so they're going ex to extend that double currency event and that's really really cool now this is what actually uh, bothers me the most now i do not own these rings nor band of air no band of darkness uh, people wanted asked on the forums multiple times that band of air and band of darkness be bind to account on pickup and they did it band of air is now bind to account on pickup and two cannot be equipped at a time band of darkness is now bind to account on pickup and two cannot be equipped at a time okay but here is the note that is really really bothering me note that this change is binding only affects rings acquired after this fix goes live which means that whoever acquired this band of air and band of darkness is still going to have uh, their rings bound to character uh, i know people who ran this 400 times on a hardcore mode to get uh, band, band of darkness or whether band of air it doesn't really matter okay now what they are what people are supposed to do run it again 300 400 times to get it account wide no just no this this is a very 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 bad thing i don't like it i think you're making a big mistake with this and i don't know that that's all i can say this is for me unacceptable this is embarrassing so uh, whoever is running for the band of air or band of darkness if you're close wait for, wait for the patch if you want to use it on other accounts because if you if you craft it before the patch it's going to be bind, bind to character and also console only armor kits can now uh, once again be properly applied to items so these these are the patch notes thank you for watching uh, north side is out